Welcome to another tutorial, Web Hosting Control Panel, cPanel Video Tutorials. Changing your password. This is assuming that you've opened up your control panel already and we'll be concentrating on this icon here, Change Password. Click the icon, be presented with a screen where you can enter in your old password and your new password and verify your new password. I want to draw your attention to this area down here, which is the password strength. Now, the reason why you may be changing your password, perhaps your account had, has been hacked or compromised and you need to create a better password, I thoroughly recommend that your password has uppercase, lowercase letters, as well as numbers and perhaps even a special character. You can use the uh, password generator button here to generate a new password for you and I'll show you that. So first of all, we'll just put our old password in and let's just push this password generator button. As you can see, here's an example of an extremely strong password. Of course, you would probably never be able to remember that password, but you may have a program called RoboForm or some other password storing program. You may be able to write it down somewhere safe and you will need to do that because some of these passwords are quite complex. So say for instance, we generate a password, we just keep changing it until we find one that we might feel comfortable with and we can use that password or we can enter in our own. So one, say for instance you had accepted this one, you have to say tick, I have copied this password into a safe place. It will then, you click the use password button and it will populate those, those two fields there. Now here's the very strong meter. It's 100 out of 100 strength password which is extremely important. So what you want to do is you want to, if you need to, you can type in your own password. So if I put the word password in, let's see what the strength of that is. As you can see, it's an extremely weak password. But if I add the numbers 34 after it, straight away it's jumped up in strength to 36. And then if I add, say, an exclamation mark after that, it's, it's growing. And if I put the first letter as a capital, it's becoming stronger again. And so that's what I suggest that you do, is you try to make extremely strong passwords out of perhaps sequences of letters and numbers that you can remember. And then once you're happy with that, you can simply click the Change Password button. So I'm going to change my password. And it will come back. Ah, okay, you're not allowed to use dictionary words either. So let's click that button there. It tells you the explanation. We'll go back and try again. So there you go, you're not allowed to use dictionary words. This is a piece of information here that will help you to understand what you should and shouldn't do for your passwords. But make it more than seven characters, use a combination of letters and numbers and special characters, Avoid familiar items, names, phone number, and avoid dictionary words. So this will secure your account from it being compromised or hacked by a third party. This ends the tutorial on changing your password. Be sure to check out all our other cPanel tutorials to learn how to use all the great features of your web hosting account. And build your online business.